Hi, Charlene back talking to you about Heaven Gua, number six, metal. And now I want to talk a bit about the symbology. I did mention in my last video, it's the father masculine energy. So it has this really beautiful, um, abundant energy in terms of the father provides. Now that's traditional, older traditional ideas. But remember the times that the I Ching were, the I Ching and all these, um, the trigrams of the I Ching were developed. That was the patriarchy. And now we're coming into a more balanced energy. What we want to work with in this energy is ultimate creativity. So having said that, if you look at your home and you're missing the area of the Northwest, you may be missing a very important masculine energy. Now in traditional relationships, that would be the father. In these, in these days, it could be two women, two men, single people, but we all have a balance of male and female. So we need that masculine metal energy to really flourish in this area and make sure we have abundance. So in terms of plata, that's, that's silver, which is metal is symbol, symbolized by gold and silver and bronze. Also the color white, spirals and archways. So this is the area symbolically that has to do with the flow of money, the flow of energy to keep everything happening. So we have abundance. So when you look at this particular area, this is why it should be clear and be earthy and abundant and feel good to you. So we want to, to bring that in. What we don't want is too much metal in this area so that there's a restrictive cutoff, domineering old patriarchal energy in this area. We want it to be full. And if we can, in every gua of the home, we want all the five elements to be balanced. Primarily, this area is fed by earth, which I love earth tones. I said that in the last video. I'll say it again. Really heavy, luxurious, comfortable, energetic places that we can really relax because this is a really important area to relax into our creativity. It's the time of the year. It's late fall. We're going into winter next when this is happening in our late fall, which is coming up in maybe three or four months. So I just want to emphasize the power of the symbology of father energy, of metal not being too rigid, not too much white, too much spiral, earth energy, a splash of fire, the color red, just to melt that metal and make it into beautiful, you know, symbolic jewelry, things that really bring us to relaxation, really bring us to appreciation, all that we have in our lives. It is the flow of money. Keep that in mind when you're looking at this area in your home. Thank you so much for joining me. I'll be back with what's opposite of this gua. Charlene here, Radical Feng Shui with Charlene. Please subscribe. Thank you.